Titan 23 still alive if you looked at the video uh, if you watched the video from turn 22 you know that I was here and uh, in a bad position with only 5 units to defend up against potential surely sorry uh, 6 units from Mac, 5 from Miss Vassal and 1 from him but he didn't attack so I was able to I was I uh, yeah, this one I was able uh, to attack and position myself so I, I took uh, units with um, life stealing except uh, white witch but I knew she would stay in the back line and I didn't take for instance um, my cavalry because I knew she would be at risk um, and uh, yeah, so I put three cadavers here plus the butcher because the butcher is a very very good unit and there was no chance that he would die. And on the other side, uh, Banshee plus um, infantry, remnant infantry, and, and one cadaver. Uh, I, and I engaged fight with this cadaver. He almost stayed alive, but he died in the one or two last rounds. And as you can see, it was a pretty easy battle, so auto combat. Um, but low risks for me uh, of the life and, and my heroes didn't use really mutant dead or race cadaver otherwise I would have more cadavers at the end of the battle uh, and it, it wasted my, my casting point stuff so I had casted one uh, lost soul before the fight to uh, prevent the AI from casting all my casting points during the fight so it used Dark Gifts, which is not very useful for this battle, but uh, still makes the fights even um, more quick, quicker. So he splits, and but my, my main army is, is uh, the one here, and that's why the cadaver died, because he was alone. So then she used uh, Veil of Despair. As expected. And yes, something interesting is this uh, Tigran Crawler has only 6 defense because he got cursed and still on him. So even with martial arts, arts which give plus 5 defense against retaliation, it takes a huge amount of damage from the from the Revenant Infantry, it's great. crazy. So the Banshee takes low damage, like 2 damage you can see on the combat history, uh, but it deals huge amount of damage to enemy units. So even if she's surrounded, uh, she doesn't take like, like, much damage. And as you can see, the Tribunal Prolo takes like 19 19 damage uh, because of uh, cool. Uh, sorry, a curse and uh, Stephen in. And there I use Suffocate, which is totally useless. But, mm. And so, kind of also, it's like seeing our really, really tough. Bye bye, Mike. And then the AI uh, goes on my cadaver here and kills it with two units. Yep. And then this game. Then I used. I, I, I saw an opportunity here with the trading post uh, that had two uh, fl uh, fires and so I used the movement points that I had left to attack the training post and I managed to go strike the fires um, and raise one cadaver and kill the rest and my hero leveled up to level 14 and then I took 
um, bane of the Anitra with it so that I can deal more damage to uh, animals from the Arctrids. So as usual I, I split them uh, with a lot of soul to have more time to deal with one of the flyer and the main objective of this fight was to uh, go strike the flyers. So I put everything in, uh, in place in order to, to go strike them. And in the Vanilla uh, game, um, as you know, Dispair, uh, and Dispair uh, stacks. And in the current version of the balance mode, so it's version 10.1.18, uh, there is a bug right now uh, because the veil of this pair of the benches should not stack. Uh, you should get only. You should stack the, the moral malus, but not the purity uh, weakness. But uh, in the current version, as of 15 December, it does stack. And Zasko is working on it to correct that. But it means that right now it's ridiculous. Like you can get 100% purity uh, weakness, or even more than 100% to veil, veil of this pair. I didn't. I wasn't sure about this anymore, so I did a small test, and I confirmed. And then I decided not to use it because clearly it's an exploit. So I use uh, my leader, who has Inflict Curse, to uh, uh, curse the fire, and then he has he has Curse uh, Holy Witness, and he, he cannot move much. But then I want to remove his guard uh, to diminish his resistance by two uh, to maximize the chance of, of uh, going strike. So I don't engage it directly and I don't use uh, going strike directly. I, I put myself at uh, strike range and then I let him engage. So I just used uh, Veil of Despair. Ah, we need to wait a little for the stack to appear. Okay, so now he has Despair. And as you can see, so he has holy, holy weakness from my uh, leader's infinite despair, and then he has despair from the banshee. So the uh, info text is incorrect. It's not 10% weakness. It's 30% weakness. Uh, so that will be corrected also in the balance mode later. And so he has 60% spirit weakness uh, thanks to holy weakness from my leader and despair from the banshee. And if I use more banshee, I could get to even more than 60%. So that's really ridiculous, and um, I stopped using that uh, afterwards because it's an exploit. It should stick, uh, stick at 30% maximum. So that's what I wanted to show you on this fight, and uh, I think I can skip the rest. Um, basically, I, uh, I kill them very easily, and uh, no loss, and I so I could strike both. So now I have a pretty nice army of two flyers, uh, three benches, three lost souls, one cavalry, one cadaver here, plus butcher, white witch, four cadavers there. Um, I moved back my mystic towards the throne of my ally to will arrive next turn if we need to defend. Still I think we should not defend but we will see. Mac is here. And Epcan is here. Uh, so actually, I should take a screenshot of this. Remember where it is. Max Ron has three, um, three Sun Guards, and I will take next turn. So next turn, I'm going to take these two sides, take the throne, and then I'm going to move through this uh, and do the Lost City and stuff. And we will see, and maybe go underground and then move toward uh, FKM because on the ground it's much faster. Um, and for my cities, uh, so I had not enough gold, so I delayed the, the settler again, and uh, instead I built a fortress here, and uh, I finished the fire next turn. So that's it for this turn. And uh, yeah, I launched um, and they plague because I plan to cast an ended plague with my crow and the uh, high spirit here on the on the city we can guess here from the houses. So thanks for watching. See you next turn.